right now I'm about to eat me some cereal and stuff really quick. All right, so this morning on the agenda, we are actually going to Tesla to go and test drive a Tesla. Today, it'll be the Model 3, so I'll insert what that looks like here. I'm here still getting ready in the back. All right, so we are now in the car. So it's officially 941, so we're about to drive over there and we will see you guys when we get over there. made it into Tesla. We're running a couple minutes late, but we're about to go and see the car. Are you excited? I know I am. I'm okay. tired. I'm tired too, for real, for real. I was kind of tired. As y'all can see, it's like raining. But this is a perfect time to test drive, so you can see how a car will do, especially these type of cars in the rain. So, yeah, let's go on in. Oh, that's, oh my God, that is so cool. <laughs> and then all of these settings same to your driver profiles, so you don't only have to set it once. Okay, that's perfect. Okay. okay. Yeah. And then we'll close this out in the top left corner. Okay, and then we'll, yeah, just close that. Perfect. So what you're looking at here, the left side of your screen is always there. That's your exterior controls of the car where it's showing park at the top. Okay. Your range. Um, once you're in drive, your speed will be right at the top. Okay. okay. Um, you can open the front trunk from here, the rear trunk. You do have automatic rain sensing windshield wipers that'll click on here in a moment. Okay. Um, black bar across the bottom of your screen is your interior control. So the biggest thing here is your climate. Music. So you got music, climate. climate. Um, this was the one that we saw. Temperature, yep. Heated seats on the black bar on the bottom. And then you actually control the vent air movement on the screen there. Yep. You got it. <laughs> Do you feel anything? Oh, I feel it, yeah. I feel it. Oh, okay, there it is. There. Uh, Temperatures, heated seats, front rear defroster, far right, and then volume for your music. So this one, right yep. There's a cool heat and then. Yeah. Y'all think I won't need that today? Cause it ain't. It's it's cold. It's kind of cold, but it ain't bad. Sure. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. And then um, we the navigation there mm -hmm. on the right hand side or in the rest of your screen. Okay. Um, it is set for the test drive route for you. Okay. There you go. Yeah, and then we are programmed Drive as well. West on Ohio so 126 like that, West for two or here. three miles. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Cool. Yeah. And then um, if you've seen it online or read about it, you remember that regenerative braking. So when you take your foot off the pedal, you have to start to slow. Now there's no coasting though. Okay. So just slowly let off that gas pedal and the braking is going to kick in for you. That's your ah. biggest driving difference today. Okay, so it's going to pre-brake for you. Yeah. So do you like for it's in park, if you want to put it in drive, do you just press the D? No, 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 it's use this. The gear shift on the right oh, hand okay. side. Yeah. So it'll change as you go up, yeah, park, so reverses hit, up, oh. drive is down, parks up button on the end. You just get confirmation on the screen there. Yeah, so you'll look here to make sure you're yeah. in the right gear. All right, cool. Okay, feel okay? Yeah. Okay, I put my seat on. And then of course, your, when a car comes delivered, your phone is actually the primary key for the Model 3. Yes. Uh, the backup key is this key card, so I'll give you that. Okay. What about the key fob? What is that all about? You can get a key the key back of this car. Man, you do not want any kids in this car. The key is primarily on your phone. Yeah. And then this is your back. Yeah. You imagine what you gotta do to keep these seats clean. Okay, so put on the brakes just to wake up the vehicle. I'm gonna stand back because the wipers are gonna kick on. Put on the brake. Put on the brake. Okay. And then all the way down for drive. Oh. Just put it into here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And then you can just open the trunk and you can roll up the window because those wipers are gonna kick that water in. So you're good. Okay. Alright. Thank you. Look at you driving the Tesla. Happy? Yeah, this is good, right? Hmm? Okay, I'm gonna have to readjust this camera lower than I thought. <laughs> <laughs> now turn the bottom on. North Korea's Kenwood connector. 
right onto Kenwood Road. Yeah, so I'm really excited about this. Now turn right onto Kenwood Road. Yeah, it literally, it, it's breaking for me. Well, it's not breaking completely, but it's slowing me down. So it's a little bit slower to... Yeah, because this is all you've been talking about. Yes, I'm so excited. We in a test test, baby. It's actually not that bad in here. It's nice. And you don't even have to use your phone anymore. That's right here. But it's just gonna be an adjustment because I'm used to using my phone. You do not want any kids in this back seat. I wouldn't get the white. It's like I wouldn't get white. Completely I get, white. I would get black. The one that I'm looking at is black. Can't you like customize what this is gonna look like? Yeah, that's what I was saying. This looks this is new. I still don't Are know about this electric. But I, I mean, I like how you can actually see the entire road. You can see the front of the car. In five hundred feet, turn right on. Oh, you take my mask. <laughs> Maybe you do need a test. Now turn left to take the Ohio 126 no. West Road. <laughs> I this got me sold right now. You I got know. you sold. He knows, yes. I don't know, because I don't know nothing about no electric cars. Let's try browsing. Let's get the feel of it. Yeah, it's like Well, how does it feel? Did you drive it? It feels great. Honestly, like, I love it. It's smooth. It's smooth as hell. That's what a lot of people that own Tesla were saying that it's a smooth ride, and I definitely feel that right now. And like I said, the only thing, guys, that's different is that the car does start to pre brake for you, and I'm not used to that. I'm used to having to do it myself, so that would be something that would be different for me. Because you know, your girl, she's steady having her foot on the brakes, okay? Because you never know. You people, this car is like oh. I mean, like that prime example, what if something flew off the back of that truck? Ooh, I'm swerving this car right over here. You about to get me fucked up on test drive, okay? Period. I mean, that wouldn't be your fault, though. Yeah, it wouldn't be, because I'm, I'm just on test drive. Then they should have them doors locked. Y'all, this car, it, it has heated seats. My ass is so warm right now. Like, I love this right now. I'm not saying you can't get heated seats on any other car. But it's nice. And also, as y'all can see on the screen, it has like the speed limit. Instead of it being here, it's all on here. So you can literally glance real quick. Boom. It's nice. I like, I really like this car a lot. This is, this is nice. This is everything that I thought it would be. And again, guys, this is the model free Tesla. So this is the lower, this is the standard entry. Consider the entry level Tesla. Brake starts to break it for me. So every time you lift, you lift your foot off the gas and start breaking. Yeah. So that's what she was talking about before. And you adjust, guys, as y'all saw when the lady was here, you adjust everything from here. The only thing you can't, you can adjust your... That is kind of cool. Still. See, I don't know, like, I want to be able to control the car. Like, I don't want it to break for me. What if I ain't trying to break? You can still, you can still, like, you can still control it, though. It's not like, see, right there, I just had to stop it because 
What if I'm trying to coast? And then y'all, you can see the car. It shows you all the lanes. Like if you zoom in on this or get up close to the screen in here, as y'all can see, it's showing like what's around me, like the double lines, like trash cans or whatever. It just showed the trash can over here. It's so, that's awesome. Cars, it's showing cars and stuff. It's telling me like, what's on the screen and stuff so this is nice the one thing i do appreciate about this car because you do it all the time in a honda mm -hmm. you always on your phone with the gps you got a big one right here I yeah i that. just literally y'all i just literally listen to the gps so i don't be on like on my phone with like I gotta, before I drop off anywhere, y'all, if I'm going somewhere I'm not familiar with or I kind of forgot, and I feel like if we have kids and we teach them how to drive in this one day, like, it'll help them. So if they forget to brake, the car gonna start to work out. I mean, I see safety, but at the same time, I feel like there's nothing like driving in a normal car. That's fine, too, but we'll still have a normal car. We still will have the Honda. So backing up, camera. Okay, that's nice. That's actually turning with the wheel. Actually, I've heard people say that the, that um, as far as like the backup camera is horrible. That is a freaking clear backup camera. Our cam, our backup camera is pretty clear, and it's 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 just like ours. See, that's why you have to go for yourself, y'all, and test drive the cars you want because sometimes people's reviews not always the most accurate. Let's test the like backup camera part, y'all. Let's test it out. Let's test it again. Parking into a spot. Oh yeah, that is so cool. I like that. Maybe that's how it could park. Uh, it could park by itself. And then you hit this to park, and that's it. As this would be the exact model and color, not the inside though. I could not. I don't think I could do white seats. Cause look, look at this right here. You can't. You it's can't already, do. It's already like something. You can't on do the white seat. with children. No, we ain't doing no white. All right, what do you think? I mean, it's cool, but I don't know too much about it. It's electric. You feel me? I mean, it's electric. I don't know. I prefer I prefer my oil and engines and stuff like that. I personally would not mind switching to electric because, first of all, electric cars, I feel like, is way less maintenance than a regular car. And the type of car that I want, which was a Range Rover, it, I mean, the, the maintenance on that is very expensive. So, to go on, comparing this to a Range Rover, like this one comes out on top. But as y'all can see, these are like the controls. And it's just so nice. And then like she said, this is your primary key. Your phone is your primary key, but then you can also use this as a backup key. So that's one thing I did learn today was that the little key fob that I thought came with the car, it does not. This is what comes with your car. And then you, uh, your phone is your primary key. So yeah, it's nice. So I'm gonna do a walk through the car real quick. This is the back seats. So, sun, oh, I forgot what they call that. So. This is the wheels and the tires. She looks so cute. It would be, it would be a girl, for sure.
said maybe. I didn't say yeah. Hold on. I feel kind of stupid right now. I don't know how to turn this car. Well, it ain't stupid. It's different. Like how? Okay, maybe if I. Oh, I'm 